Why is everyone looking so sad? What happened? I, I don't know how to tell you this, Jody, so I'm just going to tell you. Your mom and I, we've been transferred. We have to leave the base. We really want to take you with us, but we think... Everyone thinks that it would be better for you to stay here with Professor Dawkins. You can't be serious. They abandoned her. Of course, we'll come to see you whenever it's possible. And when you're better, you'll join us in our new home. Okay? He's lying. Well, I think it's for the best. Goodbye, dear. <clears throat> Poor kid. That's why she was there all these years. They just, they left her. When she was young. Be brave, darling. I know this is difficult. I'm sure it'll work out. We uh, gotta go, Susan. Just give me a minute, Philip. This guy is rushing the goodbye. How could he not have patience just for this one little moment? How do I kill that guy? That's enough. Come on. Are you serious? Kill him. I didn't kill him. Can I kill him? Yes, I can kill him. I'm killing him. I'm not letting go! That's just sad. Even the mother doesn't want Jody anymore. And she was in love. She loved her. But after an incident like that, I don't blame her because that's that's scary. Look, I'm totally exhausted and thirsty. And I have no clue where we fucking are, so just play nice and give me a break, okay? What is Jody doing in the middle of nowhere? I know she's all by herself and she's running away, but why this desert? How long do I have to walk on this highway? That's a long way to go. I mean, is something gonna happen? Is somebody gonna come pick her up? Oh, here we go. Stop! 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 Stop the truck! How could you leave a girl out here in this hot sun and the game wouldn't let me switch to Aiden? Because I'd, I'd kill that driver. I'd kill the driver like I was going to kill the dad that wasn't being a dad. Oh, here we go. Stop! Stop! Don't, don't make me pull out Aiden! Aiden! Go get him! Come on, Aiden! It won't let me switch to Aiden. This is some cheese. Everything's gonna be okay. I'm in the middle of nowhere. I'm dying. 
dying of thirst. And everything's fucked. But it's gonna be okay. Leave me alone, Aiden. What? Talk about shot clock cheese. That was a long highway and then just out of nowhere. It's okay, Aiden, Aiden. There's no reason to be nervous. I've got to be careful, though. Because we don't know what kind of people are out here. We don't know if they're thirsty. Maybe there's no women out in the desert. You, you never know. They might try to rape her. Every guy that we've ever seen has tried to rape her, so... I gotta put Aiden on standby. I'm, my hand is on triangle right now. My thumb is ready to press triangle at any moment. I can already tell this is gonna be bad. Sh shouldn't we go through the front door, not the back? The back door is a mistake. Hey, I'm so sorry to disturb you. I I'm just looking for some place to spend the night and and I was hoping that you can't stay here. Sorry. Oh, please. It's gonna be really cold tonight. I I have nowhere else to go, and I promise I will be gone by morning. I told you you can't stay here. You need to leave now. It's okay. You can stay here tonight. Come in. What's your name? I'm Jody. I'm Paul. These are my sons, Corey and Jay. My mother, Shimasani. Don't be surprised if she doesn't answer you. She hasn't spoken in years. We're about to have dinner. Would you like to eat with us? Yeah. Yeah, thank you. So far, so good. They look like nice people. I don't think she's going to get raped this time. But I'm on standby. I'm ready to let Aiden fly at any moment. As soon as they get a little too comfortable. Take some of that corn, girl. For someone that's been walking around the desert on a highway, not getting picked up in the sun all day. She doesn't look very hungry, does she? She's not going through that food that quickly. She's just kind of like, okay. Even the water, she's sipping. Okay, well, she did sip that pretty fast. Does anybody talk in this family? This is the most boring dinner I've ever seen. We don't see many hitchhikers out here. Can I ask where you're headed? Where is she headed? Let's let's tell the truth. I just keep moving from day to day. I guess if I keep going long enough, I'll figure out where I'm headed. I see. Hmm. Let's go with X. You guys are um Navajo, right? We're Dene. That means the people in Navajo. That's what we call ourselves. How about alone? This is the uh, first ranch that I've seen in, in miles. Mm. There used to be more of us. Many have left for the city. It's a hard life out here. Those horses are making a lot of noise. Do you breed horses? Yeah. Mustangs. We also have a bunch of churros. Churros? 
sheep. We sell their wool and milk. It's not much, but it keeps us alive. hell is going on? I knew they weren't telling the truth. Listen to this. Are you coming? I'm right behind you. Even though I have no idea what's going on. Everything seemed fine and now we got this crazy music. You stay in your room. No matter what you hear. What I hear? What do you mean? You value your life? Lock your door and don't come out until the morning. Okay. Well, that's not a very good explanation, but... He looks serious. So I'll do what he says. I'm just gonna go to sleep and pretend like nothing ever happened. But it sounds like they've got their own items. I've got an item and he's been saving my life for years, so I'm not scared, but who knows, maybe they have their own items too? Maybe that's what's happening outside? I have no idea. But here we go. I know. It's a very strange place. Don't worry. Tomorrow will be a long way from here. Good night, Ivy. Maybe this is nothing to worry about because they did seem confident as they were walking to their rooms. You stay in your room. No matter what you hear. Calm down. It was just a nightmare. I know that old woman was looking scary, but <laughs> it's gonna be okay. Remember, you have Aiden. They don't. Shit. What's going on here? Aiden, Aiden. Find a way to open that door. Here's Jody. Disobeying somebody else again. She's always disobeying, and it always gets her into trouble. So you already know. Okay, well that guy looked terrified. He's got his hands over his ears. This can't be good. Okay, that guy saying a prayer. Now I know this can't be good. This is very bad. Go back to your room right now! Please, Judy. Just do as I ask. This is something serious. This is something fierce. Everybody is absolutely terrified. What is going on outside? I've got to see. I told you to stay in your room! What the hell was that? Go back to bed. You can leave in the morning. I don't really know what to think of this place. They've got their own items walking around out there. 
Well, actually, that's even worse than Iden because you can see them. At least with Iden, you can't see them. Those guys, they're right there in the flesh. We've got to get out of here. That's what we got to do. Put those clothes back on and just get out of here. Never look back. This was a mistake. We wasted a lot of time doing this. Who is that? What in the world was that? What is going on here? I'm leaving. I'm out. See you later. No more questions for me. I don't even want to know. I just want to get going. Let's go to the next chapter. Because obviously there's some kind of voodoo, some some kind of something going on here. You looked exhausted. I told the boys to let you sleep. Thanks. I I really needed it. Made some coffee. Why not take that coffee? She's going to need it because she's going to need to get real far from here. I'll make sure she's awake. Yeah, that's real good. Take another sip. Keep taking sips. Oh, keep keep going. Keep taking sips until that thing is done. Three sips and it's over. That's a splash. All right, I'm out of here, guy. See you later. Or actually, I'll never see you again. It'll be like I was never here. Road. Thank you. There's a lot of work to be done on the farm. Maybe you'd like to stay on for a few days. Lend a helping hand. Couldn't pay you anything, but uh, you could have a roof, food on the table. What do you think? Find some more clothes in Corey's room. See you outside. So I wanted to leave, but she wanted to stay. Okay. Ready for work? I'm ready when you are. The sheep need water. Think you can handle that? Sure. They got her doing chores out here. They don't know that she's more capable. They they don't know she's got Iden. So I don't think I'm going to tell them. If they give me the option to, I'm going to lie. I wonder why Jody decided to stay. She was terrified last night, but now she's like, ah, I'll stay. I guess because she figures where is she going to go, right? I guess it's because people don't want to pick up hitchhikers in this state or wherever she is. Maybe she's going to steal that truck on the right that we just saw. Maybe that's her plan. So, you're gonna stay well? It looks that way. Great. I mean, it's good to have some help. Thanks, Judy. Can you get some hay from the barn? First it's water, now it's some hay. What's gonna be next? Am I gonna have to milk the cows? Or do they even have cows? Who knows? Let's see if I can talk to this old woman. I didn't might be able to talk to her. Hi. My name is Jody and, and I'm I'm gonna stay here for a little bit and help out. I hope that you don't mind. This is beautiful. Did you make this yourself? That woman can talk. She's hiding something. I don't know what it is, but so something's going on with that old woman. And we're going to find out. Before we leave this place, we're going to find out what she's hiding. What's really going on here. I guess that's why she's staying. It's the curiosity. Oh, wait, what was that? 